Hey, how's it going on YouTube? Welcome back to another brand new video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can optimize your network connection, decrease your internet latency and fix your packet loss as well as internet issues with this one video. I hope this video helps you out. Make sure to watch it till the end. Also do leave your specs down in the comments below so I can reply to each one of you individually. And with all that said, let's get started. Alright, step number one to fix all of your CS2 network issues is using a wired connection. A lot of you guys do not understand the importance of wired connections since it helps you to get direct connection right from your router to your PC and that can help you to get better internet connectivity instead of a wireless network system. Although if a wired connection is not possible for you guys, I would recommend you guys to use a 5G band router and a 5G band receiver on both ends of your pc using a 5g internet connection is much more reliable and stable the other internet connection step number two is the window settings and for that i would recommend you guys to open up settings right on your pc then go over to network and internet go to ethernet if you have it then right over here your network profile type make sure that it is set to public and once it is done you can simply close this next thing is adding your cs2 to the firewall and for that you need to search for firewall now once you're in the advanced defender firewall click on allow an app or feature through windows defender firewall and over here click on change settings now you will have an option to allow another app simply click on it then go to browse and then go over to the installation location of your cs2 once you're in the game directory simply add cs2.exe click on open then simply click on add now it is already added for me but you have to add it right over here i need to close this thing scroll all the way down and find your cs2 over here and make sure to select both private and public sector right over here and once it is done simply click on ok and then close your windows firewall and now let's move to step number three that is using gear a booster it helps you to improve your pc's performance and helping you to get better fps as well as better network connection in cs2 you can simply go over to this link in the description below and download it for windows for completely free once you open up the application it looks like this and right on the home screen you will find cs2 right over here although it has a ton of games to choose from but for this video i will help you guys with the cs2 so simply select cs2 and then select on it now it will automatically apply the best settings and best server for the game to get you better fps as well as a better network connection without packet loss now as you guys can see in the game i'm going to get an average 58 milliseconds of ping with an improvement of over 63 percent and that is a win-win situation now gear booster offers you a ton of games to choose from and this is completely worth it if you want to play your games without lags or without fps drops now the best part of this application is the configure section where you can go click on optimization settings and enable all of these booster settings and then for the node preference select select node by speed and that's it simply close it minimize your gear booster and then you can drop it to play your game next step is create a restore point and this is really simple simply search for create a restore point on your pc select your local disk c click on configure and then, and then make sure that turn on system protection is enabled then click on create and name it cs2 network just so you can remember it and simply click on create i highly recommend you guys to not to skip this step because it is really essential and it will help you to save all of your windows files even if any setting goes wrong you can always revert back the older settings next step is the cs2 network optimization pack i'll be leaving a link to this down in the description below you can simply open this thing up and first one is the cs2 optimization where you need to apply the cs2 high priority disable background applications as well as pc optimization this will help you to improve your pc's performance and increase the cs2 priority then next one is the network optimization and over here you need to run the network optimization batch file as an administrator running this file will help you to disable all of the unnecessary services as well as all of the network consuming applications in the background only restrict them while you're playing the games and this will be really really beneficial whenever you're playing your games once you're done with that you can close the fps pack and then move to the last step that is the control panel tweaks and for that you need to open up control panel on your pc look up for network and internet connection so once you are here you need to click on it select your ethernet or your wireless router simply click on properties and once you are here go over to the internet protocol version 
IPv4, click on configure, click on yes. Now once you are here, simply go to power management and make sure that all three of these options are disabled. This will disallow your PC to turn off your device in order to save power. This will keep on getting a constant flow from your device, from your router to your PC and that will help you to get a stable internet connection. Now you need to click on properties once again, double click on internet version protocol 4 and now over here click on use the following DNS server and use 8.8.8.8 for preferred DNS server and 8.8.4.4 on the alternate DNS server. Once it is done, simply click on OK, then simply click on OK and then close it. And once you're done with that, simply close the network sharing center and you are good to go. I hope this video helps you out to increase your CS2 performance, decrease all of your network issues as well as get better input latency. Well, if this video helped you out guys, make sure to do leave a like and smash the subscribe button. We'll see you in another video. Until then, stay tuned. Keep watching Bear Fox and peace out.